Hello and welcome to the podcast, Every Moment is Sacred, where we interweave meditation and healing into everyday life. I am your host, Rain Elizabeth Stickney. Now, let us begin. Welcome back. For those who are here for the very first time, welcome to Every Moment is Sacred. This is a wonderful podcast journey where we get to explore meditation and healing in everyday life. Today we have a meditation journey from Stillwater Meditation. And today is the 28th of June, 2023. So do you know what that means? Do you know what that means? It means that tomorrow on Thursday, the 29th, is the very last day of Stillwater Meditation Online in the form that it's been taught for numerous years. So if you'd like to join that group one last time, maybe for your first time ever, please go to my website, rainelizabeth.org. You can click on the Stillwater Meditation tab and you will be guided to the simple way to register, receive a Zoom link, and then at 3.30 p.m. Eastern on Thursday the 29th, you can join me and those who are there for a sacred group of connection, meditation, guidance, and gratitude. I welcome you there. Still Water Meditation can also be found on Insight Timer, where some recorded meditations are available to you, to anyone for free. And of course, on this podcast, there are many meditations that I share. And eventually over time, all the meditations on this show will also be on Insight Timer and vice versa. So you can choose if you want to listen to a podcast or simply listen to a meditation. Both will be available. I have some very exciting news about this show and one of our upcoming guests, Jesse Krebs, will be visiting us. I'm looking forward to this conversation with her. She is a wilderness guide and expert teaching survival skills to women and to all people. And she specializes teaching women and those who are identifying on a non-binary spectrum. And she also teaches to men, but she focuses on the women folk and people who are comfortable in female-only settings. I have just met Jessie. I have just met her through a neighborly connection, a phone call introduction. We have yet to record our episode, but I will be seeing her in person. One of the reasons why I'm so excited about this conversation is because Jessie also has childhood trauma and, and also meaning me. Maybe you, some people in our audience have childhood trauma. Jesse and myself have both found solace in nature. Now she is much more skilled in wilderness skills than I am. The connection being a joy and a love of the beauty and safety that's found in nature. I can go on and on about her, but just look out for that episode. And if you get curious about who Jessie is, you can look her up. She has a masterclass. She has lots of information online. J-E-S-S-I-E, Krebs with a K, K-R-E-B-S, B as in boy, Jessie Krebs. She's coming on the show. I also welcome you to find me on my Facebook group, which is a private group. 
So there are some questions for you to answer in order to join, but it's free. And in that group, only in that group, I'm sharing my mom's poetry during this summer break. So I have 82 days of summer break with my son where there's a lot of parenting going on on my part. And one of the ways I wanted to help myself get through this was to do something fun and something new, which is record videos of me reading my mother's poetry to you. The goal is that I will publish her work. So there will also be some sort of publication available to you and to the world soon. But first I am just sharing her words of wisdom in poetic form for fun. The Facebook group is the same name as this podcast, Every Moment is Sacred. It can be found by going to facebook.com slash groups slash every moment is sacred. It's a bit of a long web address, but it all makes sense. Facebook.com slash groups slash every moment is sacred. Join me there. Enjoy some poetry. You also get some sneak peeks and references to podcasts and some other information about gratitudes and connection with like-minded folk. So please join me there. I think that is all of the announcements I have for you today. And this meditation that I am sharing with you is... Like I said, from Stillwater Meditation, it was originally recorded on June 15th, 2023, so very recently, and it is all about the wind of breath, breath, wind meditation, and it is appropriate for all audiences. If you are a regular listener, you have heard my announcement about this show being intended for adults. And I have found out that children and teens are listening. So I'm being extra mindful about when an episode is really appropriate for all audiences who are interested. And when an episode is really about adult content, I am trusting you parents and caring, loving adults to supervise any children listening to this show. I have meditated all of my life. So I don't find any contraindication with meditation and people at any age. At the same time, sometimes talking about healing and meditation can lead to an adult conversation that is intended for years that are older than 18. (laughs) There are many nuances here because technology is freely accessible to people of all ages It's also true that people mature in different ways at different ages. So with respect to all of that, I want you, dear listener, to make good choices for yourself. And whenever you are hearing a topic about something that draws emotion in you or the desire to connect with someone, Find a safe individual to connect with and share with someone who can listen to you, someone who can honor your feelings, because the topics of healing and meditation run deep, and they also help us to expand and elevate. It can be wonderful to have spiritual friends at every age. So listen with an open heart and an open mind. Gather together sacred souls, people that you love and who love you. And here, without further ado, is Breath Wind Meditation. Feel the wind of breath entering and exiting your lungs. Feel the 
wind of breath creating change within your body mind allow this wind of change to enter your heart Bring in what is new and release the past. Feel the wind of breath and consider how this is always happening, invisible as it is. The wind of breath gives us life. Learn to trust this life moving through your body form, moving through your heart, mind, moving through the universe of you. Trust yourself to breathe. Notice how breath comes and breath goes. You can pay attention or not, and breath is happening, sustaining, giving you life. Ask yourself, ask your inner guide, How best to breathe right now? Listen. Is it a deep breath you need? Is it a belly breath? Is it a relaxed breath just as things are? There are many kinds of breath. Ask your inner guide, ask yourself, what do you need right now? What is best for you in this moment? Follow your wind breath. Follow your breath wind. Notice where your breath takes you. Notice the past you let go of with every exhale. The past is over. The present is Now, welcome the future as it comes, becoming now each and every moment. Let go and receive. Breathing is happening. You are happening. You are alive and breathing. Feel this wind breath transforming every moment. What does your breath carry into you? What 
What are you welcoming into your life? Are you welcoming a calm breath wind or a soothing breath wind? Are you exhaling and allowing the past to be destroyed simply by way of letting go of what already was, what once was, what is now just a story? There are some things worth destroying. Let go of all that does not serve you. Listen to your own inner voice, your own truth. What do you truly want in this lifetime? What would be nourishing for your body, mind, heart, soul? Harmonize with all parts of yourself. You make beautiful music. And your wind breath allows you to do so. Listen to who you truly are. Be guided by yourself. Let these words only be a reminder, a gentle pointer to you. Allow yourself to be directed back to you so that you listen within and move about through this world with your own inner peace. Thank you so much for listening. It has been a great joy to have your presence here in this podcast. I welcome you to celebrate the joy and wisdom in your life exactly as it is. And I welcome you to feel loved, fully loved, exactly as you are. www dot rainelizabeth dot org